morning everyone. We are in Ljubljana right now and I am so excited to show everyone what it looks like. We are at the Triple Bridge and this is like one of the most iconic places in Ljubljana apart from the Dragon Bridge which I will show you later. But I think I'm going to make this video into a montage with bits of speaking in the middle but I feel like I'm at home. I feel bad that Leon's not here but this is so exciting. Lots of people practicing for their music over here. Also get very excited over bin gardens. the last time I was in this square and it looked like it would rain in random places just in a little tiny area all by itself and for a long time Phil and I were very confused why was it raining in only one area this is crazy and then we realized there were these wires which were kind of like sprinklers and would sprinkle little random areas every now and again and I just remembered it when I walked back here just now I remember finding this what's it called vending machine Vending machine, well, vending milk machine. When I was with Leon last time we were here, and we're gonna do it now. come out to Ljubljana Castle and it's incredible, it's so beautiful and we learned a lot about the history that I can't tell you about because I can't remember it. <laughs> We've just dropped the food because we're having dinner. We were getting pretty hangry and tired, so we've come to apparently the best pizza place in Ljubljana. And I'm pretty excited, I'm not gonna lie. I'm excited for this pizza. It better be good. We're getting a family sized pizza, so they're ginormous. So we basically did Ljubljana in a day. Um, if you want to know more of what we did and where we went, then I will put it in the description oh. below or comment and ask questions. They've been having lots of installations all over Slovenia and they do some really cool artwork. Um, and we're going to try to find some of these installations. Some of them are light installations and some of them are water installations. Some of them have been around for a few years, but the light ones are recent and it's part of a project called In the Dark. And it's pretty cool. We're gonna go try and find some now. So I hope you wanna join us on the adventure. 
So this is one of the art installations and before I just thought it was very weird heads in a thing going up an alleyway but apparently it gets water and it goes down. I don't understand the meaning, I'm sure there is a good meaning about it but, but it's still pretty cool. So if anyone knows why that happens let me know because we have no idea.